<laughs> okay, but you have to promise not to laugh. Too late. I'm already laughing and I don't even know the story. Fine, but if you snort laugh again, you're buying the next round. Come on, spill it. My coffee's getting cold from suspense. See? This is why I can't tell you anything serious. What if I told you that you can take a regular image and turn it into a talking 3D animated character with your own voice and without spending a single dollar? Stick with me because I will show you exactly how to do it using free AI tools, even if you've never animated anything before. I will show you how to go from a simple image or idea to a talking 3D cartoon character perfect for YouTube storytelling, animated stories, or TikTok, or just fun. We'll be using free AI tools to generate our character description to bring the character to life in 3D and to animate it with lip sync and a gesture or without paying a cent. And by the end of this tutorial, you will have your own animated character ready to speak in your own voice. If you're excited to get started, make sure you comment yes in the comment section below and subscribe to our channel because more value awaits you. Now, step number one, we need to create our character description using a free AI tool. You can use Google Gemini or you can use ChatGPT for this process, we need a solid character concept. I'm using ChatGPT in this tutorial. If you do not have a character or a character description, you can give ChatGPT this prompt that says, help me describe a 3D cartoon character for animation. I want a female character with red curly hair, wearing a yellow hoodie setting in a modern clay. And just like that, ChatGPT will provide you with a detailed character description you can use for your 3D cartoon animation. All you have to do is copy this prompt and paste it into an image generating AI too. But I already had an idea of the character I want to create, so I generated this prompt that says two 3D animated cartoon women sitting in a warm, cozy indoor cafe, laughing and holding white ceramic mugs. I'll leave it in the description below. And at the bottom here, I told ChatGPT to give me two more prompts I can use to generate the images of these women individually while keeping all the details, accessories, and the background the same. And ChatGPT went ahead and gave me the first prompt for the first woman, which I can use to generate an image, and the second prompt for the second woman. You can ask ChatGPT to refine the style and accessories or suggest different angles of your characters like facing forward. And once we are done, step number two, we need to generate 3D characters. Let's take the description and turn it into a 3D cartoon style image using a free AI tool, Leonardo AI. Head over to Leonardo AI and sign in for a free account. you find the link to all the tools I'm using in the description below. Once you sign up, all you have to do is click on the launch app button. We will select image. Now, Leonardo gives you about 150 free credits every day. Now, here what we want to do is go back to ChatGPT and copy our first prompt for our first two characters and paste it in the prompt box of Leonardo AI. From there, we can choose the model or preset we would love to generate our images in. I will select flux context. I will leave the prompt enhancer on. I will leave the dynamic style on. And on the image dimension, I'll select this one. Once that is done, I will close this tab. As you can see, it will cost me about 50 credits because of the model I'm using, meaning with 150 credits, I can only generate three images. But that's fine with the type of videos that I'm showing you. Just click on create. If you choose a different model, it's more likely to consume less credits. So this is the image it has generated for us. <laughs> very beautiful, very amazing. So I'll download this image into my PC by clicking on the download button. So what I can simply do is go back to ChatGPT. We copy the first prompt for our first character alone. Come back to Leonardo and we paste it here. Hit create and repeat the same process for your second image of your individual character. Okay, this was the first image. This is the second image and this is the third image. I think I love this AI feature. It creates or generates high quality consistent images. Leonardo AI faces a lot of difficulties when it comes to creating consistent character, but with Flux context, it's able to produce high quality engaging character, which is just so perfect. If you're enjoying this so far, hit the like button and let me know in the comment section below. I would really love to hear from you. So what I'll simply do is download them into my PC. If your image dimension is not what you wanted, you can simply come to pixelcut.ai, upload your image here. Once the image is uploaded, make sure that expand is selected and you will see the aspect ratio here. Click on custom, 
and you can select a 16 by 9 or any dimension of your choice so we'll go for 16 by 9 and we can see the space here all we have to do is click on generate and we'll see the size of our image being increased once you increase the aspect ratio of your image what you can simply do is upscale it by clicking on the upscale button here and it will just look so polished and so beautiful this is the before and this is the after being upscaled from there just download and repeat the same process now when we pay close attention to this image it's on the opposite angle to where we wanted it to be according to our first image it's supposed to be on our right and not on our left now what we can simply do to flip it is come to canva select youtube thumbnail upload your image increase its size and click on flip and we'll have our image in the exact angle and position as our first image all you have to do is download this image into your pc once your images are ready and make sure that the characters are facing the camera if you want a clean lip sync in the next step if there are issues with eyes background noise or awkward lighting regenerate with minor prompt tweaks like clean up background or direct eye contact or soft shadow once we are done with step number two it takes us to step number three where we need to bring our characters to life using every animating software hydra.com this is where the magic happens making our characters talk and move about now once you're on hydra sign up with your google or email address once you sign up it will bring you to a page like this asking you what you would love to create for us we want to create videos so we'll select video once the interface loads we can see that we have been given 300 free credits that we can use to generate our videos as we can see this is the model that has been selected Hedra character 3 when we click they have these uh, premium models we can choose from if we are on the paid plan then here we have the aspect ratio depending with what we are creating we'll leave it to 16 by 9 and this is the resolution which is 720 pixels and here we need to select our duration but it is set to auto now here what we're going to do is click on the start frame and click on upload image and we'll select our first image like that click on open then from there we can click on the audio and script now hedra gives you three options type your own script and use hedra's inbuilt ai voices or record your own voice or upload an external voiceover i like using 11 labs for realistic results all you have to do is come to 11 labs select text to speech paste in your script select a voiceover and hit generate but one of the most satisfying way i love generating my audio is by coming to the voice ai changer upload an audio file that i recorded with my own voice using my phone once uploaded i choose a different voice that will imitate my voice either male or female depending with the character i want and click on generate this gives me a more personalized natural sound and natural tone and emotion to my audio besides that i love generating sound effects using 11 labs for example we've got two women laughing all we can simply do is type in the two women laughing and hit generate from there listen to the results that it provides <laughs> If I'm happy with the way it sounds, I click on download and save them in my PC. Then all you have to do is click on upload audio and select your audio file. Click on open. Once it's uploaded, listen to it. <laughs> Once you confirm that it's the one you want, just click on add to video. And once that is added, here we can paste in a simple prompt that says two women laughing with simple hand gestures and hit create. If you're on the free plan, when you read through here, it says there are almost 300 generations in the free queue. Free wait time is about 30 minutes long. That's one disadvantage of using free plan. You have to wait all this while. Just click on continue. As we wait for the image to be generated, all you have to do is repeat the same process. Upload an image of your character you'd love to speak. Click on open. Upload an audio. Listen to it. Okay, but you have to promise not to laugh. Click on add to video. And here in the prompt box, we can type in something simple, like our character is talking with simple hand gestures. And from there, just hit on generate. From there, just repeat the same process for all the characters that you have. Once our animations are ready, check the sync between the audio and the lips. Make sure the gestures match the tone of your video. If everything looks perfect, all you have to do is download the video on the download icon here. <laughs> 
So here you can still see the mug on the table. Meanwhile, our character has just lifted it. This is one challenge at first when animating two characters on this platform. But nevertheless, the overall production was just so amazing. So what you can simply do is download everything and assemble them into any editing tool of your choice. Now, once that is done, you can upload the final video on any platform you are uploading your content. This is how you can use a free AA tools to create animated video clips. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. If you found this video helpful, consider subscribing to our channel because more value awaits you. From here, God bless you. See you.